By the 25th century, Earth's resources were ravaged, consumed, exhausted. Desperate and on the verge of extinction, we cast out into the void of space and discovered rich new worlds waiting to be cracked open and stripped bare. All of Earth became devoted to this effort. The planet crackers were built, the USG Ishimura the first and most famous. Planet cracking became routine. Its spoils kept us alive. Eventually, greedy eyes fell upon Aegis Seven. Restricted for centuries for reasons unknown, greed and corruption saw to the demise of caution. There, buried beneath the surface, an artifact, the Red Marker. Long lost and long forgotten. The religion I once called my own had found its holy grail, the key to human immortality. Or so we thought. It did not bring salvation. Witness the conviction of a true It brought doom. Marker bred insanity, murder, and chaos. It bred necromorphs. Those who escaped the planet fled to the safety of the orbiting Ishimura. This is Shuttle CSO-4. The colony's overrun. We can't go back. The scourge released upon Aegis-7 came with them. <laughs> Within hours, the Ishimura went dark. The corporation dispatched a small repair crew to check on its investment. Seems like everyone was trying to pack in a hurry. Among the crew was an engineer, Isaac Clark. Isaac, it's me. He had something special aboard the Ishimura. I wish I could talk to you. I'm... In the darkness, Isaac found death. It was not alien, it was man-made, and it could be used to stop the outbreak. Isaac also found Nicole. Thank you, Isaac. I always believed in Dead by her own hand, she was an apparition of the marker. Isaac engineered his escape. But everything else was destroyed. Three years later, he wakes in a hospital on Titan Station, an Earth-Gov metropolis on Saturn's largest moon. Isaac has survived, but his mind is no longer safe. For the marker changes all. Hello everybody, and welcome to my playthrough of Dead Space 2. I recently played through Dead Space 1, and now it's time for the second game. Isaac, are you there? Come in, Isaac. Oh, God. I'm so sorry, Isaac. Look at the time difference. No, no, I'll call you back okay. later. It's okay. How are you doing? Good. You're right, Isaac. The Ishmer is a great ship. I am so lucky to be serving aboard her. I'll enjoy it while it lasts. You know they're going to decommission her next year. Isaac. Thank you. 
For what? For just pushing me to do this. I mean, if it weren't for you, I never would have made it this far, because you made me stick with it. I'll just remember, I'm giving you up for six months so you can do this. You know what? We must be getting out of range of their leg. Isaac? Isaac? Isaac! You were drifting away for a moment there, Mr. Clark. I believe you were telling me about your nightmares that you've been having. About your dead girlfriend. What was her name? Nicole. I didn't want it to end like this. I really wanted to see you again. Just once. I loved you. I always loved you. Yes. Nicole Brennan. She was a senior medical officer stationed aboard a Planet Cracker class vessel. Ishimura. USG Ishimura, yes. Part of a mining operation on Aegis 7. I understand communications went down shortly after their arrival. You were part of the repair mission. A mission for which you volunteered, am I right? What did you find aboard that ship, Isaac? They found something. What did they find aboard the ship, Isaac? The marker. Did you have contact with this marker? It made you see things, didn't it? Things you didn't want to see. Oh. It spoke to me. And what did it oh, say, Oh, oh, oh. What did it say to you, Isaac? Isaac. Isaac, can you hear me? Isaac Clark. Repeat, I have him. Great work, Franco. Be careful. He's been out a long time. Oh, yeah. Okay, good. Good, good. Steady, steady, steady. We gotta get you out of this straitjacket. Where, where am I? Alright, I, I know you're confused right now. I can explain everything, but you gotta trust me, okay? Listen, you're in terrible, terrible danger. Oh! Oh. Ew. Franco. Oh god. Franco, what happened? Oh god. Isaac. Isaac. Oh crap. And I'm already in it. Damn, this is Fast thing! Oh no 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 no! Not the bat again! Whoa! I'm not going that way. I'm going this way. And I'm move! Ah! God damn it! Ah! Ah! Oh! Oh! oh get off! A a a a a a! Having a spanking a! Oh! God damn it! I mean. I mean, I, I've already seen this, but still, <laughs> it freaks me out. God damn it! I knew it was coming, and I no. Oh, damn. <sighs> well, oh my best friend, Dave Station. Whew. Save this one. Well, uh, first of all, I'm going to say that I'm playing this on casual instead of medium setting. Mainly because it's. Well, <laughs> Dead Space 3 is coming in just a few days, and I'm mainly playing through this for the story this time. I should have. But I did it for the story in the first game too, but. Uh, Oh. Ah. Yeah, right. So. Damn, beast. Alright, um. Oh, just through that. Yep. Good. Whoa. This is Director Tideman to all project personnel. Jesus. 
subjects terminated and the facility scrubbed. This is not a drill. Type it out. Uh, and to prepare for this, actually, also seeing both the movies, but the downfall, which is actually take place just before the first game and aftermath. But, well, I guess, yeah, is taking place just before this game. Yes, I'll schedule you for another session tomorrow. No, no, I, I don't think I'm ready. I, I don't think I can take another Whoa. session. Oh, there. First thing tomorrow. Now yes. let's talk about what you saw today. Come on, Strauss. I'm here to help you. It was black. Deep black and glowing red with symbols. Symbols whispered to me. Symbols whisper to you. Come on, Strauss. What? It was just short. It was just short, but it put so much stuff in my head, so much shit in my head. It's the more room for Man, that's no one Strauss. From Aftermath. Remember what he looks like? Like that's it. Actually, quite cool. Strauss, what did the symbols <laughs> tell you? Yeah. Well, let's continue. I'm, yeah, I'm still in a straight jacket, so totally defenseless. That's just peachy. Oh, that. That's not a good beginning. Oh! Ah! Come on, man. Eight and four. I remember you. <laughs> I said we all the key subjects need to be eliminated, Listen. terminated. <laughs> Which one more? Listen to me, man. Will it matter? Listen to Will me! It matter? We can both get out of here. <laughs> just just cut me out of the straight jacket. No one's getting out of here alive. Oh, I don't do it. Oh. Ah! God, that. Oh. There's no escaping from what I've done. <laughs> take it easy, buddy. <laughs> Just take it easy. The rig is red. It's red. It's a health bag and a flashlight in that wall locker. You should grab them. In fact, that's great. Um, oh, yeah. so I press B to. That's great. I don't have to go into the inventory every time. Well, I actually thought he was stabbing me. Isaac, we're all gonna burn for what we did to you. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's oh my god, cut his own throat like that. So I got the flashlight. Yep. yep. Wait, wait, wait. Just hold on there. And I'm back. I just realized that. Hello. Clark! Isaac Clark, is that you? Who are you? My name is Dana. I'm the one trying to rescue you. Why? What's going on? You're suffering from a unique form of dementia, Isaac. Something you contracted on age seven. How do you know that? How do you know all this about me? Your dementia will kill you. 
But if you can get here, I can treat you and get you to safety. Why should I trust you? Because I'm not the one shooting at you. Fuck. Just follow the route I'm sending you. Well, as I was going to say, I noticed I didn't have subtitles on, so I turned them on. Well, so, I'm not sure I'm going to trust anyone in this game. I know what happened in the last, yeah, the first game. So, and uh, trust isn't really working for me anymore. Whoa! Oh crap! It's all. Ah. Let's see. Yep, that one is still working. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Oh, something moved faster forward. And I guess I need to use my flashlight every <laughs> Because I don't see anything here. And uh, this is just a fla flashlight. So, I can't actually do anything with it. I have to... What is this? Some type of rec room? Chessboard? Some... What? Uh, someone is doing a model of the marker. That's never a good thing. Oh. And... God damn it. Jump scares again. Oh. Let me get this wall. walker. Ah, oh, I can't. Ah. Oh, I'm back. It's blocked. We want some more health. Something. Uh, oh, but instead of help, I got the save station. Come here. And to save. And let's go in here. What is this? Oh, some type of shower room, I guess. <laughs> that was a failed jump scare. A minute. If the marker was destroyed on the planet, how the hell am I going to get affected by it? I don't get it. Oh, great. Ventilation shafts. Are they really going to send me through ventilation shafts? Oh, let me. Oh! And without any weapons. Great. This is really going to end up well. What's that? And I can't even see if something is behind me. Oh, peachy. Yes, peachy. Oh! Why are you helping me? 
If Tideman finds you, more people will die. Including me. Not if you follow my route. I don't like this. You don't have to like it. Just hurry before you get locked in. All right. Oh, mass or something. Yeah. Well, oh, what the? This is all that. Oh, look at that. Kinetic, telekinetic soldier binding. Okay. So, do something with this one. Um, can I? So, uh, right? Yes, um, what the hell am I supposed to do now? Pick something up and throw it through the glass, I guess. Oh, 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 yay! What? Oh, 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 oh! Pick up something, pick up something. Come on, come on. Oh, oh, oh. Holy! Oh, oh, one more, one more, one more. Oh, one more. <laughs> and I've nailed them to the walls. Alright. Stump is. Still stump. Oh, and oh, let's get that. Some money. Oh, uh, no. One more of these spare things. <coughs> Yes, um, that way, but first let's check if there's something here. Only about that people. So. so, oh, I guess I have to drop this one. Press that one. Oh, another hell. Can I can do step two. Good. Now, uh, I think I'm going to end this here. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.